During the Bingsi distributions in Myanmar, many local charity groups and youth volunteers also came to help out. Some of them serve as translation volunteers, while others help with the distribution work. Working hard to transport the bean seeds, the 22-year-old volunteer used to be a CGK recipient several years ago. But this time, he turns from a receiver to a giver to help the people in need. The people that we are distributing the bean seeds to are farmers. I'm also a farmer, and we are all poor. I can feel the farmers' hardships in life. So next time when CG comes to help them, I will also take part in the good deed. Zizi continues to distribute Manbin seeds in Myanmar. Local volunteers have mobilized to help. The female volunteer serves as an MC as she hopes to inspire people's compassion through her influential way of hosting events. When one of the farmers was on his way back, he donated a thousand Burmese kits that he brought with him on that day. I was deeply touched when I saw it. As the distribution site, in addition to city volunteers, many charity groups and enterprises also lend a helping hand. Our organization is also doing charitable work to to help those in need. So when Tsuji came here to conduct the distribution for farmers, we decided to do our share without hesitation. I contacted the government by letters to inform them that Tsuji was going to distribute the bean seeds. We also searched for quality bean seeds to be distributed to the flood affected farmers. Besides the distribution sites, volunteers' care for the farmers also extends to their homes. After seeing their living conditions, we came to realize what Dhamma Master Zhenye often says. It was not until we saw their suffering that we learned to cherish our blessings. Being able to help with translating today, I feel very happy. The seeds of Siji's great love have also been planted throughout Myanmar, inspiring more people's goodness. Uh,